Everybody's gone to the rapture. Except me, I assume. That's what the game's called anyway, but I assume I play as a character. Anyway, in case of emergency, stay tuned for important broadcasts. Settings say, make sure you have the safest environment in case of the emergency. Uh, may make the difference between life and death. Start says, the emergency may occur with little or no warning. Be prepared to meet any emergency. May be key to survival. So definitely, they have in they have in universe explanations for everything. That actually stays true for these settings too. Like brightness, power may fail during the emergency. Survivors may find the world is darker than they expect. Adjust your exper expectations of light levels and stuff like that. It's kind of cute. So this is the new game from the people who made Dear Esther, the PC game that is mockingly called by some uh, the like Walking Simulator 2012, well, which was this. Almost like the f not the first, but it was one of the games that kind of spurned this ongoing wave of artsy games where you kind of walk around an environment and hear people talk about stuff, and that's kind of just the game. For example, uh, Gone Home would be a big one of that. Never played Gone Home, never played Dear Esther. I'm gonna play Everybody's Gone to the Rapture. Maybe we'll go back to one of those other games some other time. This is Dr. Catherine Collins. I don't know if anyone will ever hear this. It's all over. I'm the only one left. So, multiple questions immediately. How do we know everyone's gone to the rapture? And what does everyone mean? Like, everyone, everyone? Or just, like, a lot of people? Are there other characters at all in this game? I'm sure that's that kind of question is what this game's going to be about answering anyway. Well, big inviting blue door sounds like a good first stop. I'm going to continue to broadcast for as long as I am able. If I'm right, we should be able to pick up the signal right across the valley. The event has left markers. We don't understand it yet, but we're going to keep working to try and understand it. You can use them to find what you're looking for. The answers, they're all here. The answers are in the light. Well then, right off the bat, then we're now established that the person talking is not us. It kind of sounded from the intro that it might have been a first person voice, but it's whoever's talking over these radios. So we've confirmed there's another person at least. I'm going to continue to broad- I was trying to see if I could pick up that, uh, cassette. Can I crouch at all? Looks like no buttons do anything on the controller, except looking with right stick, moving with left stick, and X interacts when given the option. Don't know if that signifies anything. One, 
Looks like I can't interact with anything around here besides that. Okay. We have a map. Oh, constellation map. That's probably not going to help me find much on this planet. Oh, there, that's a much more useful real... Well, not real. Uh, local map. We have a forest, a farm, Little Tipworth, a lake area. Oh, there we are. We're right down here by the observatory by Harvaton Waters and Yalton. I assume that this is the area the entire game takes place in. Oh, I can interact with the doors. Wait, I, I knew that already, of course, because that's how I got in here. <laughs> what about this gate? This is 30. Th 30 miles per hour or door 30? Can't open this up. I assume it's a speed limit. I... Okay, so it looks like we can't sprint or hustle at all. So this is the rate we explore at. Nice ambience, at least. Oh! That's not a bird. I thought that was a bird noise. This is a special announcement by the Emergency Measures Committee. Due to exceptional circumstances, radio and television in this area has been brought under the control of the EMC as per the Crisis Preparedness and Action Bill of 1982. Keep your radio and television on at all times. Stay indoors and avoid contact with other people. Do not attempt to telephone outside your local area. Do not panic and remain civil and calm. Stay tuned to this station for updates. This seems to be an automated message that predates whatever the event is that took everyone away. Or at least that's what we've been that's what I'm inferring from the uh name of the game at least and the lack of people so far. There was a weird white light up there. Not sure what that was. What's in here? No interaction here. Did it happen again? Or was that a tree wind? Anyone in here? Let's check the side door. Nope, no people for sure. Oh, okay. So we're probably in England? Or Australia? Uh, does Australia drive on the, on the left side of the road? <laughs> ah, we're, we're in some country that drives on the left side of the road. I would assume England or similar island European countries. Getting distortion and sounds. Oh! The place where I saw the crazy light. There's a little glowing light in the middle. I moved it with my controller. I'm trying to do my job. You two will be the only staff on site for this rotation. I'm just saying, if the main gate's power fails, then there's no way in or out of the observatory. That's why there are backup generators. Jesus, why the hell are we even discussing this? Just don't you come running to me if you get locked in. If we get locked in, we won't be able to come running to you, will we? You let us worry about the clever stuff and you can concentrate on sweeping up leaves and changing light bulbs. Happy? Now piss off. Ah, so. That was unnecessary. Just because you're angry with me doesn't mean you have to take it out on everyone else. Kate, can we just talk about this? Mm, Stephen, I'm done. I just want to get out of this place, and tonight is our best chance of doing that. You prep the arrays, I'm heading up to Tower 6. Kate. I love you. You know that, right? Yeah, I know that. Come on, let's get started. So we're seeing Kate and Steven now. Wow, it got real dark for a moment there. Alright, so... Now the question is, are, the, are any of those people still around, or, this is, or is this exclusively backstory from before this all happened? Can't open this. Property of Valis. Authorized personnel only beyond this point. Keep calm and carry on and all that. Can I interact with this still? No, it's... Really, it's locked open. Oh. I must, I must have been standing in the way, I guess. Alright. What, what is down here? This might be the forest that was on the map. I didn't exactly record it all in my head. Oh! 
There's another light. Something to follow at the very least. What's doing? Jeremy. Jeremy, come back! Don't leave me alone. The time of day is changing very quickly as the sun just sprints across the sky and all the all of the uh, shadows move. Maybe we're already in the rapture. Where are you going? Was there anything over there? No? Jeremy, come back here. I apparently can only move at this speed. I have a limp. Oh, it's beautiful now. So, at one point it was just flat out dark. Haverton Road. It was it was darker earlier, but then it quickly went like pitch black during that uh, vision. And now the time has been changing yet again. It looks like it's static though. The shadows aren't moving. Ah, uh, come back here, Jeremy. I don't want to play this game right now. Play hide and seek with your siblings or something. Oh, where'd he go? Not seeing him around. All right. Who's that? Hello? Kate, if you can hear this, you need to shut down the optical array. It's using the observatory as a conduit to reach us, and it started spreading its range beyond the valley. Kate, we can't afford to let it do that. It's getting stronger. I'm going to call Clive back, and I'm going to force him to order the strike. I just don't see what other choice we have. God knows Clive, if can you hear me? We need help. Who are you? Okay! Welcome to your nightmare. I've done, I've done as little research as possible about this game going into it, because I didn't want to spoil anything, and man... Already, already getting unsure about what type of game it's going to be. District of Haverton, welcome to Yalton. Please drive carefully. I don't think I'm allowed to drive in this game, so that'll be pretty easy. There's the glowy light again. So there's something in the phones that we don't want to play with. Oh, wow. Homeward bound, anyone? Jeremy, come back here, come on. I'll catch him sometime next year. It's cool. Oh, hello. Moving my f moving it around. Oh. Don't be so hard on yourself. We've all had rejections. You haven't. <laughs> come on. We'll look at the figures. Tighten up the data and resubmit. Your core idea is sound. You just got the number slightly wrong. Don't patronize me. I'm not patronizing you. I think you are a brilliant man, Dr. Appleton. Listen. I'm here, right? We're together. You and me. The alignment event tomorrow. It's yours, okay? You saw the opportunity, you ran the numbers, even if they can't see it. I'm proud of you. Is that supposed to make me feel better? See then. Look on the bright side, I'm around here. <laughs> You're a hero. Prodigal son returns, right? <laughs> I'm surprised they haven't erected a statue in your honor yet. <laughs> Oh, you can laugh all you want. But I'll bet the parish council have a subcommittee working on that right now. <laughs> <laughs> all right. I'm starting to wonder if we're going to find out that they caused all this. Oop, there's the, t there's the time of day changing again. It's freaky watching the shadows move along. Could your number be up? Some sort of raffle? More map, showing me where I am again. Move from the observatory down to the main area of Yachton. Still looking at the same map overall. This one... I think this one might have more road information than, than the other one did. Say no to Valus Extension. Is a sovereign... tower really necessary? It's a little hard to read through the grading. To register your complaint, add your name to the... petition or make your voice heard. 
Contact Barbara Foster at the surgery. Emergency meeting. Everyone is welcome. Uh... Some- tomorrow- Okay, that's really hard to read with that handwriting through there. Uh... Village... Tomorrow night... Oh, t Village Hall tomorrow night at 7 p.m. Uh... F FLV... Quarantine... What they are not telling us. Call Meg. Alright, oh, little note here. Derek, you massive dickhead wanker. <laughs> Alright. I look like a grading on, and uh, personal handwriting to suddenly make it hard to read something. Can I- oh, 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 hello. I guess I should have seen that coming. Of course it pulls. Anything stashed around here to look at? You will unlock dramatic music. All right. Get to keep, let's close the pen before the dramatic music all gets out. Don't want it escaping. It'll run wild, and then what will happen? 412. Highway 412, maybe? I don't know what road signs mean in this country, to be honest. Just gonna put that out there. Some sound happened over here, though. Was it out, was it out back or inside the building? Oh, is time of day changing again? No, I'm just walking into the shadows. Silly me. Hey, it actually closed it. Didn't sit there. Radio, talk to me. Give me guidance. Extraordinary. The whole thing reminds me of high school. <laughs> Seeing Mars for the first time. That same rush of excitement. My hands are shaking. That's all she had for me? I think these are audio- I can't tell if these are audio diaries or if they're, or if they're live. Maybe- maybe I've already been raptured. Maybe this is all... What I'm seeing afterwards. Can't interact with this door, so I can't go in there to look closer at stuff, really. A children's bike. Abandoned. Some calc. A whole tent set up outside. These are very affluent families with massive backyards. I don't... I haven't lived in this kind of area or known anyone to live in this kind of area. Little garage? Alright. Let's find out if I can go inside the house. I suspect not. These windows look like the kind of placeholder windows for buildings you can't explore. Oh, never mind. There's a whole room inside there. I thought they were plastered over windows. Still locked, though. Maybe I should try the front door. At the very least, we found a little little radio there. Just need to piece together the context for them. I'm wondering if that... First doctor... Quarantine. This area has been quarantined and sealed as per Crisis Preparedness of Action Bill of 1982. Do not attempt to leave. You will be detained. You do not attempt to telephone outside your local area. Please keep your radio on at all times. For further information. I'm wondering if that doctor is going to turn out to be the one that caused all this, perhaps. The one that's all... The one that, that Kate's trying to encourage, but seems to know something. Or was, has been de developing something. Close until further notice. We've got the flu. Please try the seventh whistler. We'll be back in business as soon as we're up and about. George and Helen Gables. Alright, Gables. Oh, you got a fine establishment in here. It'd be a shame if you were to lose it. Um... Huh. Cigarette smoke is still burning. Or the cigarettes are still g giving off smoke anyway. Finkelstein. So whatever ha whatever the event is that has caused people to disappear... ...happened so recently that we can still... ...there's still cigarette smoke around. That is a- that's a very large spoon. Alright. What can we find around here? Today's special, local fish and chips. Pub quiz, Wednesday at 8pm. 
curry and pint. Only two pounds, I I think. I think the euros are the are the E, right? Little dart game. Lots of details in this environment. Lots of smokers got vanished, apparently. Today's special, local fish and chips. Ale of the day, 50 pence. Can't go in here. All right. What about back here? Just another door to open. Ooh. Cassette? Nope, can't grab it. It would be a good touch for showing how everyone just vanished if they had uh, audio playing out of the cassette. Let's take a look around the back first. Anyone in the bath? Anything in the bathroom? Nope. Can't even walk up to the door. Alright, maybe that is the way to go now. Wouldn't be surprised if they use blue doors to kind of guide us through the area. That seems to be the setup so far. Some, that's a tall glass right there. Oh, and it's just two, it's two glasses stacked. This is a detail. So that's pretty much what this game's gonna be. A lot of walking around audio diaries and navigating a beautiful environment and see what we find. Oh, he's back. Damn it. He's in a hurry. I'll never catch him at that rate. Anything in here? No? Oh, is he... Is he staying put? Can I come to him? You know, they, uh, see me as an outsider here as well. Is that supposed to make me feel any better? Oh, I understand it's difficult. That's all I'm saying. Your lot up at Vallis have never mixed with the local community. People here, they don't really understand what you do up there. Are you trying to get me to come to your church? It's not just about faith. It's about the community. Be involved. Be seen as part of it. One of them. <laughs> Good morning, Father. Lovely day. Oh, hello. Uh, Mrs. Appleton, isn't it? It's Dr. Collins. Lady scientist. Whatever next. Good morning, Barbara. Father Wheeler. You really think that's a community that will ever see me as one of them? I can live with them staring at me. They just stay out of my way. Wow, what are they so uppity about? No, come back! I want to talk to you about something. Oh, he's really in a hurry. Let's take a quick look around here. I'm not in a great big hurry like he is. I'll take a quick look around here. Oh, it's getting darker. There's a whole backyard. Oh, yep, there's a radio. Better take a look. Oh, is that a... Oh, there's a whole sound. Oh, an explosion happened back there. There must be something to investigate. Private parking for customers only. Let's do a quick run over by that obvious radio we just saw. Interesting that's the same radio everywhere. It's a very popular brand, apparently. I keep looking, but it makes no sense. The area we picked the pattern up from can no longer be located on the scope. That's just not possible. You can see significant changes to the quality of the ambient light in that part of the sky. It's overexposed. Like a Polaroid left in direct sunlight. Thought I'd take a look around. There's the... Oh yeah, that's the, uh... Back there's the phone booth that freaked out on me. Alright, yeah, let's head to where that light happened then. I think that's all we're getting around here. Huh. Well, at least this game has visuals going for it. I'm gonna go for a really slow stroll through the environment, at least it looks nice. The stars at night. They're all drawn together. Treehouse. The constellations are sketched out. Oh, there he goes again. Well, that's nice. Look at that. Yeah, my, my sewage, the sewage drains in my area don't look like that. Or I guess maybe it's just a maybe it's just for a pipe for running water through and there's no sewage. In or out. Where was that where was that explosion thing it did earlier? Narrow road. Where are you going, buddy? Oh! Hello something. Something right? Get out of my way. Where's Kate? Where do you think she is? Stephen, what's going on? Screw Kate. It's all her fault anyway. What's that mark on your face? Stephen, 